Good morning, Quadcopter 101, and what I got for you today is a review of the new little Beta 65S, another Whoop competitor. I had previously done a review of the larger Beta 75. This is the smaller uh, version of it, the Beta 65, and uh, let's go over its features. First off, it has a uh, 580 TVL camera uh, with uh, 40, 48 channel, uh, or actually 40 channel uh, FPV transmitter. Uh, it's 25 milliwatt. Unfortunately, the, to be able to change that channel, you have to actually remove this top here and unscrew the lens to be able to get access to the channel changer. That's one limitation of these little betas. I wish they would improve to make it easy to switch channels. You, one way to do it is to poke holes in the top here, uh, you know, with a, a hot paper clip and just melt through there so you can gain access to the channel changer. But again, you know, it would be nice if uh, it was already included on, on this quadcopter. Uh, one thing about this quadcopter, it does have 716 motors, uh, uh, 17,500 kV motors, which should give it pretty a lot of oomph on it. Um, another thing that it comes with is this high voltage 4.35 lipo, uh, 4.35 volt lipo. Uh, this isn't your standard normal lipo battery, 3.7 volt lipo. Uh, you're going to need a special charger. It comes with a charger for this, but um, it should give it uh, extra oomph needed to uh, fly this little thing. Um, also, it's a 260 milliamp per hour battery. My little uh, Beta 75 actually only came with a 230 milliamp per hour battery, so I guess they're now shipping with 260 milliamp per hours, which also should be an improvement over the previous Beta 75. Now this uh, receiver is an F3 Evo, uh, Seriously Pro Racing F3, uh, e not receiver folks, I'm sorry, flight control board on this quadcopter, Seriously Pro Racing F3 Evo, and it's loaded up with Beta Flight 3.1.6. Um, the transmitter, or the flight controller, has an integrated free sky uh, receiver built into it so you know you don't need to add if you know this basic version comes with the receiver already built in but there also is PNP versions of this and or PNP version of this along with uh, um, ready or not ready to fly bind and fly uh, versions with additional receivers such as uh, free or fly sky uh, DSM DS, DSM 2 DSM X and uh, Futaba of also available for this. Let me uh, check to make sure there's any I missed there. No. Uh, Fly Sky, DSM-2, DSM-X, and uh, that's it. <laughs> they don't have uh, Futaba. I'm sorry. <laughs> and also the Fly Sky version is AFH DS-2A, you know, newer, newer version of the receiver. So it uh, shouldn't have flyaway issues like older versions of uh, Fly Sky receivers. So let's go for a flight of this thing and see how it performs. Hope you enjoy this flight. Okay, let's go for a flight of this thing and see how it performs. Okay, I'm going to select uh, Acro and arming the motors and away we go. Hope you enjoy this flight. See how it feels for this thing first. Going around us. See how it feels. Okay, let's give it a little oomph here going down the road. Notice it's football season here. They got the sleds out here for the kids. <laughs> Local high school. Yeah, that's a nice little flyer. I'm flying with stock pids. Let's see if I can do this. I got a bit of a breeze today, so I'm going to see if I can get through these trees. But I did get through that one. Let's see if I can. Oh, no, I ain't going to get through that one. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice little move. These whoops come out, you know, you see so many clones, but you know, these beta ones are pretty zippy. I'll give you that. Let's go around here, it's coming around, coming around, lining up. This time I'm just gonna try to line up for it. The wind's picking up, but yeah, I got through it. <laughs> coming by us again. Yeah, the kids are nice on this one. They seem to be nice, ready to go out of the box. <laughs> that wind. Yeah, there is a breeze today. I'm trying to fight it, but just keep going by us again and again. Okay, let's go up high a bit. I want to try something. There's a little whoop. There we go. <laughs> no, that's. <laughs> <laughs> 
Got to be careful there. Yeah, going around the trees again. Let's slalom the trees. Here's the sleds. Football babe. One here through there. Let's find an opening. Whoa, here we go. Let's go through here. There we go. Huh. Going through the trees. That's what the whoops do, you know, you're made for this kind of threading the needles. So that's what I'm doing here. There we go. <laughs> this again is the Beta 65. Um, find and fly. Again, you know, it's interesting. They have, they uh, make these with integrated uh, free sky transmitters, or free sky receivers in them. So that they're ready to go. That what's good about that is that really doesn't add much weight uh, to these little quadcopters. Um, you know, you add a uh, PN or a, say a plug and play, or you add your own receiver. Uh, that's going to add some weight. But having it integrated right into the receiver, you know, it, that saves you some weight. And weight is important in these little things, especially little betas. Still going strong. There is no beeper on this, so uh, you gotta really should. I should really be timing this, so it's probably gonna drop from the sky when its time is up. But I'll see how much flight time I got through there. <laughs> got through there too. Let's get some close-ups of it before the battery does die, and. It should be getting close to uh, flight time right about now. It's starting to feel a little sluggish. So here it is up close. There I am. <laughs> wife. It's still flying, but feeling sluggish. Oops. That's it. We'll call it quits there. So hold on, folks. I'll get my hat. Thanks, love. Okay, see ya. So that's the little Beta 65 and it was flying in the wind. <laughs> I'm surprised this. Normally these little ducted fan things uh, don't do well in the wind. Okay, I'm not seeing any flashing lights or anything like that, but I'm going to call it quits there because I don't know. You know, that was about three minutes of flight time and I don't want to go push it too hard because I don't want to damage these batteries. But that's the Beta 65S. Neat little quadcopter. Very maneuverable uh, and... Uh, actually quite powerful <laughs> for a, a uh, whoop clone you know I was surprised you know again the wind here look in the trees the wind is actually blowing and it was flying through it so hope you enjoyed this flight this quadcopter 101 signing out